thought I better introduce this studio vlog a little bit because it's a little bit chaotic. So I've been expecting to have my YouTube subscriber plaque, my 100k subscriber plaque, arrive for a while and due to like delivery times things just took a while so you'll see throughout this video i was basically waiting um with much excitement for my 100k plaque to arrive and it does eventually arrive i can promise you that but as like i was waiting i i think i did some voiceover stuff for a video i printed and tested some prints we were stamping boxes and stuff there's just a bit of a mis mish mishmash there's a bit of a mismatch of things going on and also before we get into the vlog footage i just wanted to let you guys know about a really cool competition that is happening so msi are actually hosting a creator awards so it's the msi creator awards 2021 and msi is actually a world leading pc brand for gamers and designers so i'm very excited to actually be a judge for the awards. So I'm judging the graphic design part of the awards and basically I'm gonna give you a bit of a summary. I'm gonna read it to make sure I don't do it wrong. But it's an awards which honors the most creative and outstanding creators from all over the world. So it's three categories. We've got graphic design, which is obviously the one I'm judging. There's film and there's also 3D design and the awards gathered thousands of amazing projects and pieces in its first year so they want to do it again and they want me to invite you guys to get involved. So basically if you create graphic design related things, if you create films, if you create 3D animations, videos, anything like that, you can get involved. The theme this year is technology meets aesthetics. I've actually been designing this little piece of artwork. I will leave like a full explanation of the theme down below and there are some amazing prizes up for grabs so depending on which category and which tier of winner you are you can either get a laptop, you can get a graphics card or you can get a monitor and you can also submit work that you've created within the last year so it doesn't have to be a new piece it can be something that you created maybe for a uni project or just like a personal project and the winner will be getting announced on june the 16th so like i said if you are a creative in any of those fields please do click on the link in my description find out some more and submit your work you've got nothing to lose and you could win some amazing prizes so yeah thank you msi very excited i am actually working with them a few more times coming up so you will see that very soon and i guess that's kind of it don't forget to enter that competition and find out more about it and let's get into this disheveled yeah, very exciting vlog. Hello, welcome to a little studio vlog. So this one's gonna be a little bit of like a weekly-ish vlog because fingers crossed at some point this week, my silver play button will arrive from YouTube. I applied for it like maybe two, three weeks ago and it keeps getting stuck in customs because of Brexit. So it was actually originally due to arrive today when I'm filming, but as of last notification it was friday so hopefully it won't be too long but i thought whilst we wait i might as well film a studio vlog and kind of update you today i've been filming a lot of videos i've actually just finished filming a little like work from home essentials video you'll notice this dungaree in that video this is another lucy and jack dungaree that i've recently bought and i'm obsessed with so yeah hopefully if you are now working from home and need some tips and um, whatever hopefully that one's good yeah i'm i kind of i was struggling with getting started filming actually i was getting kind of the fear and i didn't really know what to do about it but i ended up filming a patreon video which is my first ever exclusive patreon video which was like a draw with me style podcast thing so i didn't actually have to have my face in it i just kind of drew and spoke which really helped like bridge that thing of me being a bit awkward and i don't know why i felt anxious about filming considering i filmed myself for like six seven years of my life but because today's been a big filming day i have a lot of mess that's been created <laughs> i need to sort the mess out i'm gonna change into some loungewear either loungewear pajamas i don't know probably pajamas let's be real i'm gonna work on some new products actually let me show you one of them I'm not actually quite sure where I put it. Not the best camera angle in the world, but we will deal. So 
I can't wait to have a big office. <laughs> There's too much stuff in here. So I have this little organiser thing that I bought probably over a year ago. I saw it in the middle of Lidl. If anyone else loves and appreciates the middle of Lidl, you are welcome here. I love the middle of Lidl. I think that's me showing my age. It's basically like a tools organiser, you know, for like screws and stuff. And in here I'm going to put stickers because I want to start doing mirror decals and like vinyl stickers, things that can go on like a water bottle or the back of your phone case or whatever. So this is the first product that I will be releasing this month or will it have just released when this vlog goes live? I don't know, but this is getting released. I'll um I'll let you know in the description of the video. It's a little mirror decal. I actually need to go to Asda and collect click and collect thing because I want to put this on a mirror and I saw a really cute mirror in Asda for eight pounds. I'll collect that in a second actually before I put my jars on. So yeah, that is the first mirror decal. I have some plans for other ones. They are here, but I'm not like finalized on those. So that'll be coming in the months to come. And I'm also thinking of doing bookmarks. Let me know what you think about me doing bookmarks. I've just bought this, which is completely not in English, but it's a corner rounder because I want the corners of my bookmarks to be rounded but to buy them like ready done it's really expensive so a lot of people a lot of Etsy shops do it themselves how does this work then do you twist it I mean I'd read the instructions but it's not in English is it oh okay so you put it in either side so this one I'll leave the link to it in the description it's got small medium and large on the top and then you put the paper in the slots eventually if bookmark selling goes really well i'll probably get one of those like big kind of heavy duty ones but this was like 12 quid so i thought might as well do it like that that's small you can barely see it and then medium medium and large like that so, in theory, from now on, I can like round corners of prints and see sort of how it goes. Oh, it collects them in the bottom too. I am impressed. I can't get that off, but oh, here we go. It collects them in the bottom and I've just flicked them everywhere. <laughs> Good. So yeah, that's that. And when my mum answered the door to the Amazon man, I heard her say like, he must be so bored of coming to my house. But that is a gift for my mum to make the most of because she's going to be prepping the products. So enjoy mum if you're watching this <laughs> right anyway i'm gonna tidy my office i need to take my filming light down and i need to go to asda so i'll tidy first and then we'll go to asda and collect that mirror and i guess we can apply one of the decals <laughs> Um, getting evidence that I've left the house. <laughs> um, it's actually not even cold anymore. It's 10 degrees, which I'm very happy about because the cold and me do not suit. <laughs> got dark since I've been out but when my camera wants to focus there we go she focused this is the mirror I think it's really pretty it was eight pounds and that decal I showed you I've put it away because I tied it up <laughs> well, that decal I showed you is gonna fit really good on here so I'm gonna attempt to put that on here now and yeah I'll show my mum see what she thinks and I feel like this would look nice in my house anyway so good investment and yes it's like my third outfit change of the day this is what happens on a filming day. I should probably polish the mirror. Hmm. I don't have anything to polish it with. I have a sock. Why do I feel like this is a typical, like, student thing to do? <laughs> or maybe that was just me. What's the point in wa washing a um, dust cloth and your clothes when you can just use your clothes to wash with? So, we have the transfer thing, the decal. Peel it off of its transfer paper. My nail polish is not helping this situation. Wow, that took a lot more concentration than it needed to. <laughs> Then, peel it off, making sure that the letters stay on the clear part of the paper. 
you've got to have some patience for this because sometimes it doesn't like to stick and you might lose a little apostrophe you see what I'm doing keeping it on the clear part see look see the dots not got stuck to the paper so if I do it again and press it down then it will stay in the right spot it's probably easier for me to do this on a flat surface to be honest there we go so it's now on the clear part of the transfer sheet then we line it up I want to try and put it in the center a bit higher you do get a couple of chances with it as long as you don't press it down fully I think that'll work then get something like hard like a credit card or something got my starling card <laughs> not sponsored and then the trick is that's the placement of it the trick is to peel flat to the surface so instead of just like ripping it up like that you rip it like towards the surface so grab the corner again and peel flat and again if anything doesn't stick to the mirror just re-put it down before you peel the whole thing off and there is our little decal I love it! I think that's so cute. I'm impressed with myself. So I'm going to end today's part of the vlog here um, and we will eagerly await the arrival of my silver play button. Good morning. It's a makeup free kind of day today. I feel like it's been such a long time since I've vlogged without makeup on but this is my face. And today mum is working for me. We've got a lot of like product prep to do. I wanted to take some photos for the shop because we've got a new launch happening on the 28th like I mentioned and yeah I guess let's go downstairs and get to work. going to print some of the prints that we're releasing so you're sat on my printer I have the Canon IP8750 printer it's linked in my description and I'm using this paper which is also linked in the description and yeah I really like it I haven't tried many different combinations out I did use my old printer but it wasn't very good but I do love how these turn out so we're sticking by this for now let me just grab some sheets. Now there's a right and a wrong way with this paper. So I always have to like triple check <laughs> that I've loaded it in right. There's like a pale like cream side and then a white side and the white side is the correct one. Let's load the printer so it loads from the top. I've got it set to A4. It does print A3 so you have to like slide these little like things. And then I've got my laptop down here on my little stool and I need to plug my laptop's adapter in. This is what happens when you buy a new MacBook. You have to buy adapters which is a stupid move I think from Apple but here I am buying it anyway. <laughs> so I'm plugging in my printers. I have this little thing which has all three printers plugged into it and then it's just a USB. So I'm USB in it to my laptop. I had such a hassle trying to set this up when I first did it. So hopefully this actually works. Cue a time lapse. <laughs> downstairs I've just printed out all those prints as you've seen and I've actually just got a text from UPS to tell me that fingers crossed 
my play button is arriving tomorrow and it says by the end of the day so we'll see it kept getting delayed due to like customs and brexit and you know but it officially says it was in stansted this morning so see so excited so i'm back downstairs mum's just on her lunch break then she's gonna take some photos for the shop i've approved some new products for next month they're actually like vinyl stickers so i obviously print my own stickers for like planner stickers that you can write on but i wanted to do some stickers that you could maybe like stick on a water bottle or generally i want to stick mine on my laptop case <laughs> so i've kind of just design something for myself but yeah i feel like vinyl stickers work quite nicely as like decorations wherever so i've ordered this one so i've ordered this one and it'll be like i think around this size so like six centimeters ish then i've also ordered this one which is pretty much the same size and these are obviously sort of adaptations of existing prints so yeah i'm excited to see what these look like when they arrive but for now i'm gonna sit and to be honest i don't even know what i was gonna do i've sort of started organizing my office and basically i was distracting from the fact that i've got a lot of brand work to do i've got a big brand job coming up i'm actually a judge for a really cool design competition like a worldwide competition so watch out for that in the near future i'll be talking about it properly then but i've got a lot of like pre filming prep to do so i'm gonna do that now that's boring to film so if there's something for me to talk about i will pick the camera up if not hopefully the next clip will be me me with my um play button <sighs> ah hello it is now friday and nothing more interesting happened yesterday other than the fact i accidentally slipped and fell into my car and went to mcdonald's <laughs> for my lunch which was a great decision i got a text this morning to say that my parcel is going to arrive between 11:45 and 3:45. it is currently 11:34, so fingers crossed i am taking today slowly i'm not particularly doing a lot of work i'm gonna go chat to my grandma i'm gonna go stand in her garden and have a little night with her i've just reviewed some videos i've got to do a voiceover but it's a chill work day i'm mainly just vlogging to document the play button so hopefully that arrives and then i guess either tonight when my dad gets back from work or tomorrow we can put it up on my wall i think i have a spot for it that i want which is exciting so yeah right i'm gonna record this voiceover now i actually filmed for a while with like a clip-on mic and in the last video that i used it was like the harry styles redesigning video and my i pinned it on here for a start which was a stupid idea because i kept whacking it with my hand and it was really muffled so yeah i decided to switch my mic back to this one it's a blue yeti microphone i'll leave a link in the description Ooh, i need to tighten the thing <laughs> but yeah i recorded the last couple of videos with this and it was really really good the only reason i stopped using it was because when it was like sat on my desk you could hear the vibrations of me like tapping my desk through the mic and it was very annoying so i'm thinking possibly i'll just buy like a mic stand because this is like a good quality mic and that's literally the only reason I stopped using it. And for like ease, I was being lazy. It was much easier to just clip that on than it was to try and hide this in the video. So yeah, <laughs> first of all problems. But right, I'm going to stop delaying. I'm going to film this voiceover. And hopefully we can have the play button. I'm just kind of doing jobs in the hopes that it'll make it go faster. <laughs> Okay, voiceover is done it's just exporting on my laptop and oh my god i got a parcel from southern comfort the other day i'll add it to my like pr instagram highlights if you don't follow me on instagram head over there but i think i've peaked i got sent a bottle of alcohol <laughs> is this life now <laughs> but yeah they sent me like a whole kit of things which i'm very excited about because in my new house i want to have a little like bar area and you bet you're gonna see some of that on that so anyway i'm gonna go say hello to my grandma briefly i think i need to nip to the shop mum wants some things and hopefully by the time i get back my button will be here <laughs> this vlog is basically just like probably like 15 minutes of me wanting my play button to arrive is this my play button is this my play button oh it's the button oh i thought that was my parcel but it wasn't i went to asda on the way home bought some food 
I'm very happy about it. <laughs> Still waiting for my parcel. The number of people that are gonna keep knocking on this door. <laughs> it's Monday, a solid like three days since the last clip because I had like, the struggle was real. Look at my hair. <laughs> I slept on it really weird last night. But UPS have finally delivered the goods. So I've just got a very exciting like little call from my mum. I stopped jumping up at the sight of every delivery man because it was getting too much. <laughs> but. <gasps> Do -do -do! Look at that! We're gonna open it. This parcel has got me so excited and then so annoyed all within the same few days. Are we ready? <gasps> Do you remember your first subscriber? Your 100th or your 1,000th? It was packaged by Zach. That's my name! Look at it! <gasps> How exciting. Oh, it's very cold. Oh, we need to find a spot for it, Dad. I think I've got an idea of where we can put this. <laughs> the first ever award. You trying to hide from the mirror? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yay, this is down to you guys. I'm a little bit speechless right now, so I will chat to you again in a second, but I think I know where I'm gonna put it in the office, so Dad can go and get his toolkit. So um, this was on my vision board for 2020 and if you can see I photoshopped my own name onto someone else's plaque just as like a visualisation thing and now, oh my goodness, I still can't believe it, that's me, frizzy head me in the mirror, how exciting, I'm going to message my manager now and be like look what's arrived, I think dad's actually gone to get his toolbox hasn't he? <laughs> Yay! So we're thinking. Have you got a pencil? Yes, many are pencils. Right there, where oaks are gonna be. Keep going lower. Lower, 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 lower. Tiny bit lower. Yeah, there. Up a bit. Down a bit. Yeah, I think that looks good. And then when I'm filming down there. Is it straight? Yay! It don't feel real. I don't feel. I don't feel like it's happened yet. Here she is. I don't know what to say. We're all just kind of staring at it. What is it like? Six, seven years weekly videos, up to like three videos a week at uni, plus like my other channel, eleven videos a week with vlogs every day. And look at her. <laughs> I have no words. Look at this. Okay, I'll talk to you in a bit once I've processed. All right, that's it. That's the video done. I cannot believe I finally have my plaque. It's up here. The idea is when I sit and film a main channel, like main channel video, it will be kind of in the background. And I remember when I used to sit and watch people's videos who had these and just like lusting over the fact that they had one of them in the background and I couldn't believe and I couldn't picture ever having one myself. And now I have. I just cannot cannot get over it so yeah i've said this a lot but i can't thank you enough thank you for the support thanks for watching this rather rambly and long video don't forget to check out msi and their creator awards i'm very excited to be involved with that i think it's an amazing opportunity and yeah i hope you're having a good one and i'll see you next time for another video bye